after all of that surgery, you're still ugly. <laughs> now that's what gets me. Desiree Sunshine, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to my channel and in today's video, it's basically gonna be a vacation kind of prep with me. I don't know really know what I'm gonna name this video yet, but as of right now, that's all I got right now. So I went to Starbucks because today is gonna be a long day of going to appointments and doing things all day kind of busy today today yeah stopped at starbucks and got me some starbucks because today is gonna be a long day so right now i am at my where i get my eyebrows started at and it's kind of sketchy but i promise you if you don't go to a place like this to get your eyebrows started then is that really threading your eyebrows like are you really getting are you really getting your eyebrows started so yeah and it literally is like 10 to 12 dollars to thread your eyebrows i like threading because waxing just really don't work with my skin like i just don't i, I don't <clears throat> but anyways so yeah quite a few things on the agenda today so i have to get my eyebrows done today i'm gonna get my toes and my feet done and i gotta do a little um uh what is it called I, got, I gotta get like a few little knickknacks and stuff so that's basically it if you are not already subscribed to your girl don't forget to click the subscribe button also don't forget to like this video if you like this video and yeah that's it for the intro y'all i really ain't got nothing to say but so i'm gonna take my glasses off this is how my eyebrows look now they are not bad but they need a little bit of defining and stuff like that so yeah what the heck? all right so let's go in don't get my eyebrows done like I don't know it's just something about the, my eyebrows just shaping my face for me that just makes me want to continue to get my eyebrows ready but um it literally doesn't take long to get your eyebrows ready so that's why like I'm done so fast and plus I was the first one in there so I got literally right out takes like 10 minutes cost ten dollars like come on anyways so we're gonna go to the nail spa and get my nails and toes done because that's the next thing on the agenda. Like I'm making really good time. Like I'm so proud of myself right now. So let's not get distracted. Focus, that's right, focus. I got my nails and my toes done and I usually go for just like really simple French tip because I realize when I get my nails done and I try to do all these crazy designs and stuff they don't really compliment my fingers well they just make my hands look really old so I just decided a personal conscious decision that my vibe is just French tips and if you know you know so now I'm about to go eat lunch and go take my husband some lunch because that's the least I can do after the bad bitch activities I've just done. So, but right now I'm just headed to take my husband his lunch and then I got a few more stops to make. And y'all that's a wrap because I've really been up since 10 o'clock and my battery about to die. Good fucking bye. What's up y'all? So basically right now I'm just going to show you guys... I guess it's a little unboxing basically on the stuff that I got to go on this trip with. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys some of the stuff that I got 
just for this trip so let's talk about wait hold on can you see it let's talk about these babies here okay these they kind of remind me of the gucci ones actually they are literally the same ones except these were a lot more cheaper um they actually are comfortable I got mine in a size six and they fit me really, really nice. I love this color. So this is really the reason why I got it. It just gives me like really like eat girl vacation vibes. So yeah, she got those. The other pair of like shoes or sandals or whatever you, I got is because I really like to dress comfortable, cute. Like I want to be cute, but I want to be cute enough to so where I can wear my outfit with either um, some really cute flats or I can put some really comfortable heels on with them and wear it as well. So I got these because I just feel like these are really casual. Like, I mean, you can dress these up as well. And these are by Steve Madden. Yeah, these are by Steve Madden. And I got these in a size six and a half just for reference. I don't know. I have a tiny foot. So, but these fit me perfectly. I love the detailing on them. I love sparkly stuff. I have no idea where that comes from, but I love sparkly stuff. I don't, that's, that's a whole nother, that's a whole nother thing. But these are so cute. Um, and they're affordable. I know people be spending racks and racks and racks going like trip shopping, but I also went to Sephora and this is just like what I got. Like I said, this is just what I got for like my vacation or whatever. I got some of this because people will be wilding about this and it smells good or whatever, but it's kind of overhyped for me personally. I don't, it's not really, you know, but whatever so i'm gonna just show y'all what i got i got some stuff from target so i got these levi shorts from target and i got them in a size two which is a 26 in the waist and these fit me perfectly they do have a lot of stretch in them so that's really good they say they're the high rise short hyper soft and like i said they have really nice stretch and i just needed another pair of levi shorts so I got those and then I got these and if I like it, I'm going to get them in all colors. So I got it in the black color and these are only five bucks. So, I mean, there's like really, you know, just like kind of throw on like that. I got a white one and then this is the one that I originally picked up because the color is orange. I love that. Definitely give me vacation vibes, but um, like, I don't know. I just wanted to be real comfortable and chill. But still cute because I know we're going to be doing stuff for like, um, like water activities and like dirt and sand. And I don't want to get like really expensive stuff and get it in the sand and stuff like that. That's just not my vibe. That's not my vibe. I don't know about anybody else. It's just not my vibe. So there's that. And then this, um, if you follow me on Instagram, actually i made a new instagram so i'll put it i'll link it down below and i'll put it on the screen um, because i just wanted to start over just kind of like a new beginning i guess so i do have a new instagram so if you are not following me on instagram go ahead and follow me on instagram because your girl really be tripping the fuck out like please follow me on instagram and interact because yeah okay so anyways so i got this and it's a tote basically because i don't have a bag that i can just like put everything in kind of thing so i bought me a tote right Ooh, that's cute it's like this i got a little thing on it i like the packaging it's kind of simple but the little gold little thing reminds me of something like very like presidential or something like <laughs> it reminds me of presidential okay so we're gonna open this let me see i kind of okay y'all so here is the bag isn't she so cute I love this bag. Okay, so let me just start off by saying that I am in no way saying that I am too good to wear the Marc Jacobs tote. It's just like I've really just, I've just overseen it. What is that? What is it? It's just been, it's just, 
it's not that I don't like it. It just kind of reminds me of um, those bags that people put potatoes in and then they just put Marc Jacobs on it and they want you to pay $400 for it. So it's just not for me. If you have it, like good for you because honestly, I'm not even gonna cap because at first like it was like really sold out and it's really hard to get. So yeah, but then I realized that it's not really the look I'm going for. Not the look, okay, so. It's not that it's not the look that I'm going for, but like I stated, it just reminds me of a potato sack with Marc Jacobs on it. That's it. That's all that's it. But, and this is just kind of more, I don't know. I don't know. It's just, I just like this one better and that's we're just gonna leave it at that there's no reason why because i between the two totes that i wanted to purchase it was gonna be either the mark jacobs or this one but as i kept looking at the mark jacobs it just kept giving me potato sack so i was just like okay i'm gonna get the tory birch because honestly i haven't seen this one anywhere and i like it so there's that so i would like to say if you have been apologizing for things that you don't like this is this is the time we're gonna stop that i'm not gonna apologize for things that i don't like just because everybody's doing it or everybody is buying it i'm not gonna apologize for being that person and it's just be who you are authentically and just because other people are doing it doesn't mean you have to do it vice versa blah 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 you get what i'm saying you get what i'm saying but this bag it's pretty deep in the inside and it has a lot of space i really don't carry a lot of stuff so this is perfect for me but while i'm on vacation i really don't want to all of my other bags are really small i don't have a lot of stuff to carry like water and all that other kind of stuff so that's why i got this bag and it's super cute by the way love that for me that's all i'm going to show you guys of the stuff that i kind of got for you know vacation or whatever because it's quite simple it's not really extravagant or anything like that so yeah but right now i am currently in the middle of trying to pack which is also disastrous as well if you can't tell i'm really struggling right now it's just a lot of nothing is happening and it's just like i keep creating a bigger <laughs> and bigger mess and it's not giving so i'm gonna try to finish packing all of this stuff up and put it in my suitcase so that I don't forget anything because I'll be that person that will forget something. So, yeah, let's get into that. I mean, where the fuck should I really even start? I got hoes that I'm keeping in the dark. I got my niggas cross the street living large. Thinking back to the fact that they dead. Thought my raps were the facts till they sat with the bars. I got two phones, one need a charge. Yeah, they twins, I could tell they ass apart. I got big packs coming on the way. I got big stacks coming out the same. Max with me, he the way. It's a big gap between us and the game. In the next life, I'm trying to stay paid. When I die, I put my money in the grave. When I die, I put my money in the grave. I really gotta put a couple niggas in their place. Really just slap every nigga in a race. I really might tap for this nigga on my face. Yo, CC, let it slap with the bass. I used to save hoes with a mask and a cake. Now I'm like, nah, love, I'm good, go away. Ain't about to die with no money. So, alright guys, I'm finished packing as far as I know until I remember something else and I'll probably have to put it back in there. But that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys like this type of content, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, yeah, so I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.